Hey, I'm Edgar Uribe. I work at a Piatti. Uh, I'm a busser. I've worked at Piatti's for 10 years. What I like best about working there is uh, how we are all really close, like a family. I actually trip at work in the middle of uh, the restaurant. Everything got spilled and uh, it, was, it was really tough. I was finding it really hard to walk because my legs just literally gave up on me. Right away, I was like, man, I don't have insurance. I didn't have a ways of means of uh, paying for, for uh, medication or anything. My name is Jesse Vigil, and I'm the city director at Big Table. A couple ladies went out to lunch over to Piatti, and they saw this amazing worker who was constantly checking on them, and that was Edgar. Edgar was doing great, and they actually spoke to the manager afterwards and saying, hey, this guy has been wonderful. He's been checking on us constantly. He's just a great employee. He's doing a great job. So just wanted to share with the manager. And the manager said, well, you know, he's one of our best employees. He's worked with us for about 10 years. And, but one of the things that we're noticing is that he's got MS. And uh, we've seen that it's taking a toll on his body. He hasn't had any medical treatment, doesn't have any insurance. And so Martha said, hey, have you heard about Big Table? He, he hadn't heard about us yet. And she said, hey, why don't, I'm going to give you their information, put in a referral for Edgar, and see what they can do. That's when I met Jesse, my best friend. <laughs> I called Edgar and I said, hey, we'd love to take you out for a cup of coffee. This is Big Table. We love people in the industry and uh, we'd love to see how we can help you out. I met with Edgar a couple of days later. We went met at a coffee shop and I sat down and I said, Edgar, tell me about yourself. Who are you? And he said, well, first and foremost, I'm a Christian. I was like, oh, well, this conversation is going to be easy. And as we sat down and we talked, I got to hear his struggles. He was telling me, this has been very difficult on my body. He said, if it was just me, I would be fine. I can handle it. But because my mom sees me like this, it really takes a toll on me to see my mom hurting through my hurt. You know, he started to cry a little bit, and I didn't want to make him feel bad, so I started to cry a little bit. Man, when I met Jesse, it, everything changed. Like, I told him, like, man, I have God and I have my mom, but like, to have someone that is genuinely your friend, that is going to be taking care of you, it's going to uh, try to help you in any, any, any way, shape, or form, uh, man, that, that, that was... That, that was really awesome. I, I was going through a, to, through a rough time because um, I was like, where are all those friends that say that they're gonna be there for you and like when you need them the most, they're not there. And uh, Jesse literally was like an answer of God. But it was a great chance to just enter into his life. We sat down, we came up with a plan, and I said, let me look at our resources and see what we can do for you. And that night, I called one of our resources and we were able to get him a doctor's appointment the very next day. He was seen and he was given medication for his MS. And we're working on getting him a referral to a neurologist for the MS, and now uh, we're working on getting him affordable health coverage. So even, even uh, my manager noticed the, uh, the improvement that I made thanks to, to, the, to the steroids and, and think, thanks to Jesse for taking me there. It, it's, it's really awesome to know that there's a uh, you know, big table that helps people in, in, the, in, in their needs. Uh, it's awesome to see that there's still people, there's good people that help others. That relationship that we've built has been wonderful. The, the joy that we get is to enter into the relationship. That just brings a smile to my face to know that there's people that don't even know you that have a heart to help others that in need. That, that's just, just so awesome. Honestly, um, I know it sounds really cliche, but man, I feel like I could take over the world. Thank you, Big Table.